Hello, I have a quick haul video today. It's Sarah. I always say, hello, it's Sarah. Maya teases me. <laughs> I went into Joann's for yarn. I am crocheting. I am going to continue to crochet. I bought cotton today. I want doilies. I'm going to make myself some bigger doilies, bigger ones, like table size. So that's what I went in for. I saw these signs on the buttons, 65, 60% 60 off. So I go over, I'm like, oh my God, I'm so excited. And they had all these beautiful buttons. Turns out it was just the yellow dot ones that were 60 and 65. And I put half of them back because I just won't do it. I won't do it. I need a coupon or they have to be on sale, but I did get quite a few that I thought would make nice flower centers because I am planning on making some more flowers. I want to do some with that eyelet that I got from the thrift store. I'm going to cut that up and then I have, I pulled some more fabrics that I have. I also got and I went to Michael's afterward and this is Recollections. This is new, I believe, um, burlap ribbon they're calling it and this is like $3.99 I think and it's about see if it has a measurement on there no I'll show you real quick but it was wide enough I thought four inches wide to put in my die cut machine I'm gonna try and do the Tim Holtz um is it a Tim Holtz die yeah I think it is it's not the t I think it might be the tatter I forget now anyway um gonna see if I can glue together some of these these roses I've tried the rolled roses you guys saw that or I'm just gonna cut it into squares and I'm gonna make it into the other roses these that I made these kind I'm gonna use the pieces for that along with my eyelet um, and some other fabric so we're gonna see. I just thought that was a good price because I've seen it in bigger rolls for like 10 bucks and I didn't want that much so anyway but these are my buttons um, I really thought these would be nice for flower centers. I couldn't resist these. I love gold tone and two tone. So the, I, I got two packs of these, but they were only $1.75, not on sale. So you can't resist that. I got two, well, sizes of these. One's $1.75 and one $1.90. So that wasn't too bad for the pearls, which I love. And then I got a couple black. I thought that would add a pop of color, you know, or, you know, a, a contrast, I should say. And this isn't coming up very well, but it's like, it's kind of like a rope, a knot tied in the back, and then there's like a high polish part, and then this one just has the gold. And then these were actually the yellow dots, so these were 60% off. I really like this one. It's like an acrylic. It feels like plastic with the gold bead in the middle, a flower. And that was the only one of them, because I would have gotten a couple of them. Um, and then I just got these two. These are just like pearl buttons, classic pearl buttons. And this is a, like a flower, um, acrylic flower. So I got a few. These was the most expensive, $2.50 for this. I mean, oh, I hate spending two fifty or three buttons. Um, but it had the bling and it's the gold and I liked them, so I got them. And then this was what? $1.60 for these two big old pearlized I would say they're not well no they're pearly they're pearl um, kind of like carved they look carved plastic um, so I really like them and then these um, dragonflies I should say 150 that's a little expensive for two dragonflies but I don't know I threw them in there too so that was my buttons I wasn't expecting to do that oh I got these too this is um, $2.49 for favorite things, but there was a lot in here, I thought. A bunch of little ones. And I'm planning on doing um, some pin cushions. I got these two because I am going to be doing beads again. I, I have been so inspired, guys. I was watching some videos lately, and I'm going to tell you. But this one, I got these three pieces at Christmas tree shops. There's a video up. Um, I think it's pretty recent, too. It's Art, Song, and Soul, Tosh. And she does some shabby chic stuff. So I'm watching lots of shabby chic videos now. Um, and I didn't used to. So it's very, it's fun because I haven't seen a lot of this stuff. But this one is called, um, oh damn, I didn't write the name of it. But it, it's a, a, a pin cushion. Not a stick pin cushion, a pin cushion. So smaller than a stick pin cushion. And she was making hers with... Um, tea light holders so a tea light candle holder but they were crystal and I couldn't find anything like that I went to the dollar store I went to 
Michael's and Joann's didn't have it either. So this is all I found at Christmas tree shops and just wanted to make them. So I got these and they're $2, but um, I'm going to keep this one. This is adorable. It's like a little tea cup and tea saucer and it's like miniature. I don't know if you can tell that. I should have had like a bigger one over here to show you the difference, but it's small. I mean, if this is a tea light holder, you know, so I'm going to make this into a pin cushion for me. Um, so anyway, I'm going to play with those. I am going to be looking for these at thrift stores though, the crystal ones. I want not crystal, but at least cheesy crystal. Um, so what else did I want to say? Oh, I got just a few beads. I went to Michael's and got a few beads because I am so, so inspired by um, the Bead Fairy one. Her name is Lynn. And if you guys don't know her, well, I don't know. I've only seen a few of her videos so far, but I intend on watching more. But she did the coolest thing. It's a swap. She's in the UK, and it was called lace bookmark for a swap so you take a piece of lace and this is this is just i got this at joanne's too it was a dollar so you take a piece of lace not this i would rather have it like the same on both sides right and then you take a clip-on or some type of like bendable attachment here with a ring on the bottom so metal like a metal clip and make a bead dangle and her bead dangles let me see if i can pull up a picture I just ordered last night after seeing these, I went online and I ordered um, these tulip um, beads. I think they're like, here, I got a picture. I'll show you. Okay, let me see if I can show this on here. These are her bead dangles that she put on the ends of um, these bookmarks. See the lace? So that's the lace. And then there's like this like silver attachment that you put on there. And now these were for swaps, but these are the beads. See that like tulip thing? I love them. They're so pretty. So she made like a bell too. Um, let's see. There's like, that's the angel again. Now let's see if I can make this bigger. Because there was like a bell. I could have sworn. Wait, wait, here it is. Here it is. Look at that. There's like a bell with a little dangler thing inside of it and stuff. I don't know. I just, I ordered quite a few shades. I got that very one, I think. Um, and then I think I did get like a bunch of different sizes and stuff. Cause I just thought I haven't ever used anything like that. And I love it for the angel, um, bodies too. Like the little bottom of the angel. Cause I've used pearls and different size pearls and everything. Anyway, I had to get, I was like so inspired. I'm like, Oh my God. So I bought this little thin chain that I'm going to use for my dangles and I just, they just happen to have these because I've been looking everywhere. I ran out. These are just little, they're the bead gallery ones, but they're little flowers and they're so great. I've used these in my stick pins and stuff. I just think they're super, super cute. I got two packs of them and these were new. I hadn't seen these tiny little keys. I love them. Look how small and they're not like, um, really light cheesy they're kind of like i mean they're they are light but they're metal they're more like metal and then these are the brand new charm along um charms and these weren't on sale I'll, I'll get a bunch of these when they do go on sale but these just say laugh wish peace family you know love a bunch of different so i'll put them on um some dangles too so just a little haul today i am very inspired though you, you guys are so awesome and inspire me all the time um Definitely going to be making my stick pin, I mean my pin cushion, and I have a couple of little shabby chic uh, matchbooks I want to make that I got inspired to do. Also because I watched the Be one of Bead Fairy's videos. Um, so a lot coming up. I'm very ex and excited. Um, and a quick shout out to Leslie. Thank you, Leslie, for letting me know I didn't upload the the fourth part of my tutorial. I'm sorry. It's up now. So, um, and thank you all for watching. Bye-bye.